Hello students, today I've got one of the most important questions from trigonometry for class 10 and the question is if 2 tan alpha equals to 3 tan beta prove that tan alpha minus beta equals to 2 equals to sine 2 beta upon 5 cos 2 beta uh, 5 minus cos 2 beta and given you can start here given 2 tan alpha equals to 3 tan alpha it can also be written as tan alpha equals to 3 by 2 tan beta it means that 2 is transposed to this side and now but uh, and now <coughs> taking LHS if you take the LHS here and this is tan alpha minus beta tan alpha and beta apply formula here tan a minus tan b formula then it will become tan a tan alpha minus tan beta upon 1 plus tan alpha into tan beta here you can just apply the formula this point to be new, uh, note here point to be noted here in the RHS size we side we just need beta form so that we have to change all this alpha form into the beta form by from here simply so i will replace here you can replace tan alpha in, in the form of 3 by 2 tan beta minus tan beta by and here also 1 plus tan alpha can be written as 3 by 2 tan beta and tan beta and into tan beta I directly write here tan square beta you can also write here tan square beta then in next step if you have subtracted here and just subtract and this this from this then take lcm to air if you take lcm to air this two goes here and 3 tan beta minus tan beta is tan beta and two, uh, 2 is here and also take lcm here also then 2 goes here 2 plus 3 tan square beta upon 2 this 2 and this 2 get cancelled with each other and in next step you can write here you can write a tan beta upon 2 tan plus uh -huh. now uh, change this tan in the sine and cos form this will become tan beta will become sine beta upon cos beta and this will 2 plus 3 tan square beta tan square beta become sine square beta upon cos square beta okay now again now take lcm here if you take lcm here it will become 2 cos square 2 cos square beta plus 3 sin square beta upon cos square beta and then reciprocal i will directly reciprocal here and after reciprocal you will get sin beta upon cos beta into this cos square beta goes here after if you take lcm here and this will become 2 cos square beta plus 3 sin square beta okay then next step uh, you simply can cancel here this cos beta and this cos beta square uh, is cancelled here then you get here sin beta cos beta <laughs> in the numerator you get here sin beta into cos beta in sin beta into cos beta if you multiply this by 2 and numerator and denominator by 2 this will become 2 sin beta into cos beta so that multiply numerator and denominator by 2 then you can write here 2 sin beta into cos beta and 2 sin beta into cos beta is sin 2 beta you can I directly write here sin 2 beta and if you have multiplied by 2 in the numerator you should also have to multiply denominator by 2 you means that it means that it will become 2 into 2 cos square beta plus here also 3 into 2 sin square beta you have multiplied by 2 on both numerator and denominator the the 2 here is applied in the formula 2 sin beta into cos beta so you get here sin 2 beta but here 2 I have just written here as it is because we have to apply formula here and in next step you can write here sin 2 beta upon this 2 is 2 and 2 cos square beta 2 cos square beta you can uh, apply formula here 2 cos square beta means 1 plus cos 2 beta and this means 2 times 1 plus cos 2 beta cos 2 beta and here also 3 2 sin square beta means 1 minus cos 2 beta 3 times 1 minus cos 2 beta 
and it can be written as here you can write here the next step sine 2 beta sine 2 beta upon if you open this bracket this will become 2 plus cos 2 beta and this will become 3 minus cos 3 beta and 2 plus 3 become 5 and 2 cos beta minus 3 cos beta is minus cos beta minus cos 2 beta equals to r h s proved 